Let's quiet our minds and our hearts for the Catholics in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. We praise and glorify you, our loving God, who is the source of love, mercy, and peace. We thank you for giving us the gift of life. Thank you that you have kept us safe and healthy together with our families. We are gathered now to pray and to remember our beloved Maricar. We are sad and grieving because of her sudden passing. We could no longer see her rosy cheeks, her brown curly hair, and her youthful radiance. We will miss her smiles and positive presence. Our human understanding cannot grasp the reason of her seeming untimely death. But we have faith in you, our omniscient God. We implore that your Holy Spirit comfort and guide July, her husband, her parents, siblings, relatives, and friends. We entrust to you Jo Marie Lay, her little angel. Have mercy on Maricar's soul, grant her peace, and may the light of our risen Lord perpetually shine upon her. Amen. Good afternoon, being the head of the late Maricar Hemangala Manuel, I was given the opportunity to share some words of remembrance. And I would like to share memories by describing Maricar in a professional and personal uh, level. On a professional level, Maricar has a professional disposition. As a full-time general education faculty, she handles English and MSc subjects, particularly citizenship and community participation. That is why when Mang Anihabla resigned as an STP coordinator, it is my recommendation that Maricar will replace Mang Habla. The performance of her responsibilities was excellent. She has always been willing to support. She adds great value to any assigned task, any load, or any subjects given to her. She's a hard-working person and open-minded and have a positive attitude about work. Minsan lang napapagalitan ko rin kasi nga we're not perfect. May mga lapses din siya like uh, late in the submission of grades pero minimal lang naman. But she always see to it that her responsibilities always get done. Indeed, she's an asset to PwC. On a personal level naman, she's a good friend. As I imagine her face, she's always smiling, parang walang problema. When she asked me if I can be her minang in her wedding, without hesitation, I said yes. Because she's already close to me and I treated her as my anak kasi yung eldest ko kaitan niya. We'd been talking before and after her giving birth. Marami siyang tanong. Mga feelings na nagulihin, paano mga anak, SSS claim niya, and how to go about it, and many more. And I'm, I am always happy giving her advices based from my experiences. Nalungkot lang ako kasi nung nagkasakit siya, di man lang siya nag-seek ng help. Sana nakatulong ako sa abot ng aking makatawin. To you, Maricar, God knows how I value our friendship. You will always be in my heart till we meet again. Never did I imagine that this will happen. It always seems like we have all the time in the world. Our food trip banding every afternoon in front of the campus and our study body goals that I was still hoping we can still do after this quarantine but only to realize how fleeting it really is. I wish we had more time to do and say the things, the jokes, 
the bullies we save for later which we along with you is gone forever i promised to keep you alive in my memories thank you for the gift of friendship may you rest in peace farewell mama ricard Maricar, Car Marie, I will always remember you by your generous smile and happy face. In school, you were our honorary faculty in the food tech program because you always sat in our table with Mary and Gigi during school events which led you to stay in our second house here in Luz Biminda. We will always remember you here in the compound in our exchange of stories, foods, and goodies. Thank you for allowing me to play mom to you for a short time after you gave birth. Thank you for introducing me to Baby Lay as Lola Nina. Thank you for trusting me to feed, carry, and dance Baby Lay to sleepiness. I was really looking forward to your return as your little family with Baby Lay will put more laughter and noise in my house. We agreed that you will stay more often in our living room with Lei when you come back. And I believe you came back that night of June 1 as our living room lighted up while I was in my bedroom. Rest in peace, Mary Carr. We will always care for July and baby Lei. This is my take four. I always lost for words. Best words. To articulate what I feel about our friendship. But um, one thing is certain. I will miss you being so bubbly. A person who never fails to wear a smile. Person who is fun to be with. That smile you put on your face wherever you are, wherever you go, you will surely be missed. And um, I've recorded a lot of my messages, and maybe I guess uh, this is the best video that I can share. Sharing food will never be the same in the office without you around. Rest in peace, my friend. Thank you, Miss Lee. You changed my life I hope you know Cause now I'm lost So unprotected In the blink of an eye I never got to say goodbye Like a shooting star Flying across the room So fast, so fast
Life is God's gift to us. What we do with our life is our gift to God. If we had been given only one day of life, it would have been generous. If we had been given only one storm that left us unharmed, it would have been generous. If we had been given only one moment's pride in the success of our labors, it would have been generous. But we have been given life and time, joy and sorrow, sunshine and storms, laughter and tears, gifts to share and days to remember. May we, in gratitude, give back to life what we so generously receive from the giver of life. O gentlest heart of Jesus, ever present in the blessed sacrament, ever consumed with burning love for the poor, captive souls in purgatory, have mercy on the soul of your departed servant, Marikar. Be not severe in your judgment, but let some drops of thy precious blood fall upon the devouring flames, and do thou, O merciful Savior, send your angels to conduct thy departed servant to a place of refreshment, light, and peace. Into your hands, Father of mercies, we commend our sister Marikar in the sure and certain hope that together with all who have died in Christ, she will rise with him on the last day. We give you thanks for the blessings which you bestowed upon her in this life. They are signs to us of your goodness and of our fellowship with the saints in Christ. Merciful Lord, turn toward us and listen to our prayers. Open the gates of paradise to your servant and help us who remain to comfort one another with assurances of faith until we all meet in Christ and are with you and with our sister Marikar forever. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. Eternal rest grant unto Marikar, O Lord, and let perpetual light shine upon her. May she rest in peace. Amen. May her soul and the souls of all the faithful departed, through the mercy of God, rest in peace. Amen. May the love of God and the peace of the Lord Jesus Christ bless and console us and gently wipe every tear from our eyes. This we ask in the name of Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit.